is not. You're oh, right. yes, it is. It is not. You're right. Yes, it is. Do you want to sit in my car? No, I don't want to sit in your car, uh, and that, I'm not sitting in your that, No, it's called your sergeant. No, it that's ain't. You ain't seen to. me steal nothing. Then show me your receipt. I, I will not. Show me your receipt. I won't. If you took it without paying for it, I don't all they steal. Want, that, I all don't want, steal. That all I they do want, not all steal. All they want to do is I don't not steal. have you here. I don't steal. Okay, then show me I, your receipt. I, I won't do that. Then show me your receipt. I won't do that. Why? I won't do that because... Do you realize you can go to jail for that? Oh, I realize if I stole it, but I don't steal You're not cooperating. I'm not cooperating because it, you ain't got no probable cause because they said something. Go watch the camera first. Ma'am. I walk back in there with you and go watch the camera. Hold no, I'm upset because I, don't, I, I don't see this have every day. I don't have access to the camera. So how are they going to say I stole if they didn't see me steal? Ma'am, what is your name? What's your name? Come now. No, that that Calm I down. see this every day. Listen to me. Every day. Do you think, I want, any, do you, do you no think I want any trouble right but now? But do you know how many people don't walk in that stuff everybody, while you out here bothering me and they're stealing? Ma'am, they simply asked if you had a receipt. They didn't see you go through a register. That's but why don't all. they go through all the registers and ask the people if they see me? Ma'am. Let's come on, let's walk back in there. Where's your receipt? Come on, let's walk back. Let's walk back in there. Bring your receipt. Let's walk back in there. You have your let's receipt. Walk back, let's walk back in there. Just show me your no, receipt. No, no, because that's no. I'm not going to do that. I'm not that. letting you go back in the store. Okay, then. Well, Is that your receipt here. from today? It is, but I'm not showing because I ain't got no receipt. Y'all don't can't make me show nothing. I can. No, you can't. Actually, can. I can. And you're not giving me your ID. So I, I can't I prove to. that you didn't take anything. No, so you I can't don't know. Prove anyways. Why are we arguing about this? Because y'all profile black people every day like They're, that. Everybody that shops in here is mm -mm. black. Mm -mm. Yeah, everybody that shops in here is black. No, everybody ain't. Uh, well, most of them are. They is. I can pro we can profile day, anybody. I see, I see y'all up here every day bothering people. I don't bother anybody. Whoever, can you just show me your office. receipt? No, I'm not going to do that. Because that makes absolutely no sense at all. I'm not going to Can I that. see your receipt? Mm -mm. No, because they say, if they call, if they sent you out here, that, that means they saw me steal. They didn't see you go okay, through a register then, so and pay. Okay, so why not do that? Protocol okay. is step out of the car. to go look on the camera. Step out of the car. Step out of the car, step out of the car and come with me. Out no car. Then you're going to go to jail. But then you're going to have to take me to jail. Okay, step out of the car. I'm not stepping out no car. Okay. You got kid, you, all these kids in here, you left in here by yourself. Do you want me to push this further? Well, you went in the store? They, they're not little kids. Oh, they are little kids. And you left them all in the store. And what are you going to do when you go to jail and they're all here? So I call DCF to come get them all? My mom will stay right around the corner. Okay, so I don't have to call your mom to come get them. I can call they, DCF. What you, they my sister kids. They, they'll call her to come get her children. <laughs> Why don't you show me your receipt? Because Publix and everybody in there. Okay. Step out of the car. I'm not stepping out of the car. You have to step out of the car. No, you have to call your sergeant or your I, lieutenant. Come on. No. You're going no. you're gonna go to jail. No, I'm not. You're no, gonna I'm go not. to jail. No, I'm yes, not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Then give me your receipt. I'm not giving you my receipt. Come on. No, I'm you're not. Going to jail. No, I'm not. You're going to jail. No, I'm not. You're going no, to jail. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. You are going to jail. No, I'm not. I'll tell you what I'll do. No, I'm not. You're going to jail. No, I'm not. Call your mama. Come on. No, I'm not. You're gonna go to jail. I'm gonna taser you. I'm gonna tase you right here, right tase now. Me. I'm gonna tase you right now. Tase me. Get out of the car. Tase me. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. You're under arrest. You're under it's, arrest. I'm under arrest for what? Get out of the car. I'm under Turn arrest around. for what? Turn around. Call your mom. Turn around right Call, now. What Turn I'm under around. arrest for? Turn around right now for not cooperating. Cooperating. Turn around. I didn't fucking steal. Tasing you right now. Ah. Get down on the ground. Easy. Get down on the ground right now. Get down on the ground. Put your hand behind your back right now. Right now. Give me your other hand. Right now. Lay on your face. Oh wow, that's really nice. Thank you. You're Thank you, ma'am. Give me your other hand. Give me your other hand right now. I didn't steal nothing. It is. It's fine. My dad work on the police department. Oh, that's really nice. I got Go away, ma'am. Go away. Keep recording, ma'am. Idiot. Keep oh, yeah. Keep recording, ma'am. Yeah, all right. Keep recording. Thank you. Call my, num uh, my number is 549-3859. Stand up. Now you're going to jail. Yeah, yeah. Hey, guys. Just stay there, okay? I'll be with you in a second. In purse. You think I'm going to go and steal some chips? Oh, because I'm black. Almost oh, definitely. <laughs> can, can you go. call my family? Walk. 
to the car. Stop doing that to me Walk like to the that. car. Cooperate. I am cooperating. Walk to the car. Can you call my family for me? Walk to the car. It is. Thank you, ma'am. Please put it on Facebook. Hey, can you get Anna for me? Y'all so stupid. I'm kidding on the NAAC. I guess I'll That's what rich. you wanted. That's all you wanted. I guess so. So. I guess you gave me you what I we, wanted. Yeah. What's up? Good. Yeah. Oh, yeah, hold on a second. I didn't steal. Are you talking about you? What the hell are you holding me for? I just uh, Oh, it don't need two of y'all. Are you serious? That's what's wrong with y'all now. You tightening my, my hand jacket. and I'm not even moving. Get my jacket out of the You car. doing the most. Here, yeah, you can set her in here. Just have a seat. Appreciate it, brother. No, I, I just, uh, hang on a second. Fucking battery in my portable is dead. Uh, I gotta. I'm good now. I had to taser her. Can you go back over there for me and check on that car where she was in? Which car was it? It's the, uh, it was a white SUV over there. There's a bunch of kids in it. Okay. Thanks. I'm recording right now. She, uh, Anna told me that she walked by. I saw her walk by with a bag. I didn't see her at a register. Uh -huh. So I go over there to her car just to check and say, hey, you got a, a receipt. I need to see your receipt. She refused to show me a receipt, refused to show me her ID. Uh -huh. So I'm like, listen, I mean, you know, if you took something here, you didn't pay for it, they'll probably trespass you, but I need to see your receipt. She wouldn't show it to me. And uh, so, so it just got ugly over there, so I had to taser her and stuff. She's going to go to jail. I don't know if she paid for her stuff or not, but hey. hi. Phone number from her? Uh, Asking for a phone number or something to get so they get a kid. Uh, yeah. I mean, I can I can work on that. She'll, she'll give me a phone number so somebody can get the kids and get a car. Yeah, I could work on that in a second. Okay. Are you gonna be over there? Yeah, I was gonna go right here. With okay. You. They, they right. Yeah, for sure. I'm gonna call for somebody to just get them. Okay, I'll come over there in just a second. Okay. But uh. She's got to go to jail, so unfortunately I got myself in a big mess here for no reason. All she had to do was show me a receipt. She wouldn't do it. She wouldn't give me her ID, so here I am. It's a mess. Who's that other guy? Uh, he works for us. He's off duty. He's got his badge with him, so I just had him check on those kids. I'm sorry, Mike. I got a... Oh, I got some in here. I need uh, I need Anna's uh, date of birth and stuff. Okay. Her okay. information. Okay. I'll get on it. Thanks. H is seven nine three six. Seven nine three six. Can you send me a supervisor and another unit to Publix? It's seventy six twenty eight one hundred and third Street, reference to a ten fifteen that I had a taser. And also send me uh, rescue. You didn't have to tase me. You want to tase me. You want to kick me in my head. Two five seven nine three six. Everything that you did, but it's okay because I'm thanking God in advance for what you did. Two three thirty six. Two three four. We are sending two seven nine three six seven six twenty eight hundred third street. Oh, that one called. Yeah, you you should have cooperated. No, I didn't. You should have cooperated. You know, I, I don't have to. You, you do have to cooperate. Anything. What's your I do first not name? I have to give my ID. I don't yes, have you to do. Give my receipt. No, I don't. Okay. Well, that's the, that's why you're in the position you're in. It is, and I'm going to be out. And that's why you're in the position that you're in. I'm not working in WCB. Oh, well, that's that's the whole reason why you did what you did then. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine with me too. He is fine. Wonderful. Hold did on. I steal, sir? No. Did you like 793 out 35? Y'all know I didn't. Y'all just were profiling me because I was black. You seen me come through the race. Let me step out. Let me step out. Hey, um, 
Is there any chance we could check the uh, meat off? Do they have a number? Uh, yeah, the kids? They they the okay. So is the end, is it something that we could pay for us to just so I mean, unfortunately now, no. I mean, I don't know, even know what's really happened, honestly. So. Is she still stuff? I don't know, I gotta, I gotta go. Excuse me. Look at this. I need her fucking ID here. I didn't pull him out now. Hello. Hello. Don't touch me. You don't have a right to touch me. Don't touch me. All right. Walk away from me then. You refuse in service? You the sergeant, the lieutenant? You refuse in service. You the sergeant, Are you refusing in service you from us? Sergeant, a lieutenant? From the fire department, ma'am. From the fire department? Yes. yes. What is the fire department for what? For moving them taser prongs out of you. Oh, no. I, I need to go to the hospital. Fire District 31, take it 31, they're coming. Street, like, yeah, Thank you. Problem. 49, Street. I see you now. Uh, let me talk to you guys real quick. Oh. Hey, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you all what happened, okay? I'm, I'm working here in the store. I'm working mm -hmm. off duty in the store, mm -hmm. okay? I work here all the time. Mm -hmm. I see you. you come up here all okay, the time. Yeah, you yeah. know I, our face. Too. Okay, yeah, I probably, yeah, probably do. Every day. I, I don't usually have an issue up here, okay? Yeah. Occasionally I've got a problem. Mm -hmm. But most times if, if the manager or somebody tells me, hey, I don't think that person paid for an item or this person didn't pay for an item, I, I approach them and I say, do you have a receipt for the items you paid for? And most times it's not a problem. Most people will give me a receipt right away. I mean, I have a job to do. If I don't, if I don't get a receipt, then I assume the worst. Yeah. And if you're not willing to give me the receipt, then I'm going to assume you didn't pay for the items. If you didn't pay for the items, Publix is a great place. They usually want to trespass you. They usually don't want to arrest you, and they'll let you right. go on you're your right. way. Yes. Now, I'm working off duty here. The last thing I want to do is arrest somebody. The last thing I want to do is taser somebody. The last thing I want to do is mess with anybody. Mm -hmm. I'm here just to keep the peace and make sure that people aren't walking out with stuff being mm -hmm. disrespectful to Publix. That's what I'm doing. So I'm staying right up mm -hmm. here by the registers, okay? Mm -hmm. And I see your daughter walk out. Now, she had a bag, but that doesn't mean she paid for her items. Many people have bags that come in. They steal stuff all the time, every yeah, day. Right. There's yeah. all different kinds of scams yeah, that go yeah. on here, yes. even in front of my face. Yep. So I see her walking through the, through the self-checkout, walking out this way. Mm -hmm. And one of the managers is like, I don't think she paid for her stuff. Mm -hmm. So by the time I make contact with her, she's sitting in her vehicle. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and I ask her, I said, do you have your ID or, or, or do you have your receipt for the items? I don't know what's wrong with her today, but she did not want to give me the receipt. Yes, sir. She did not want to give me the receipt. I'm like, mm -hmm. if you pay for this stuff, just, keep, just let me see the receipt. Mm -hmm. And I, I must have asked her this, and I, it's all recorded. I don't know how many times I asked her. I don't want to lie to you and say I asked her 20 times. But I mean, I must have, I begged with her to show me the receipt. Please show me your receipt. The last thing I want to do is mess with you. I just, show me your receipt. She wouldn't show me a receipt. So I said, okay, well, you got kids here, you got everything else here. If you don't show me your receipt, then I'm going to assume you don't have a receipt and that you took the items. I, I, I have no idea. But if you won't show me your receipt, it's pretty stupid when I'm asking you it. She wouldn't show me the receipt. I said, okay, if you don't show me your receipt, then I need to see your ID. Well, why do you need to see my ID? So I go through the whole process of telling her, look, you have to show me your ID. I can't just let you go now. I mean, if you stole this stuff, then I'm not doing my job if I don't get your ID. She wouldn't give me your ID, and I'm begging her. Show me your ID. Just give me your ID. So she wouldn't show me your. She wouldn't show me your ID. So then, by the time I'm like, 
let me see your ID, and that, and that's too late by this time, because now I'm like, you're going to go to jail. She wouldn't show me. I'm begging her to give me your ID. She wouldn't show me. I'm like, okay, give me your ID. Step out of the car, grab her by the wrist. She bucks that totally, and that sets her off even worse. Next thing you know, she steps out of the car. I thought she was going to punch me in the face. <laughs> so I'm like, man, I'm going to taser you right now. <laughs> like, you're going to go to Okay, taser me then. So I shot her with a taser, and she falls down. I, I grab her, put her down on the ground. Somebody thinks I'm kicking her in the head, but I just put her on the ground. Later on the ground, I had to put my knee on her back to get her hand up under her to get her handcuffed. Then I get her up and everybody's screaming I'm racist and everything else. So, I mean, it went it, crazy here for no reason at all. Okay, in the end of it, did she have a receipt? Yeah, she had a receipt. Uh, a she, receipt. she paid for it. So, so what, I, what I had the manager do is, what I had the manager do is, go back and look at the they cameras. That's what so, I was so she, they, they go back and look at cameras and here's what happens. And I didn't see, I haven't seen it because I didn't have a chance to go in there, but she goes through a register, like the end register near self-checkout. She pays for her stuff. And then I guess she forgets something inside the store. So she walks back into the store, and then she comes out through self-checkout. Now, when everybody sees her walking through self-checkout, they don't recall her walking through and paying. So they see her just walking through with a bag. So that's when they call me and say, hey, I don't think she paid for her stuff. So that's how this whole thing goes down. So, I mean, it's, I mean, I just, you know, to me, I always, like, question everything afterwards. Like, how does this, why does this happen? I mean, it's just. And y'all looking on the fucking cameras inside of the thing. If you assume she did that, they should they looking on the cameras so they didn't know damn well. well they, 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 they didn't have time to know what I was dealing with. It was like one of the, it wasn't the main manager that said it to me. It was another one. No, I'm just saying. You're right. They take that time and say she's stealing. Apparently somebody in that back watching. Cause this no, no, no. Somebody no, it wasn't that. It, it was someone standing right there near me. Oh. It was someone out by the registers. So they continue on doing their business. Well, I go over there and deal with that. They don't know what's going on with me over there mm -hmm. until... After everything goes down, I didn't have a chance to tell him. So that's how the whole thing unfolds. So if she would have just shown me her receipt, then none of this would have happened. Yeah. So she's getting a, a she's getting a simple misdemeanor charge of resisting without or not for not providing her ID and all that jazz. And that's you can watch. I just need you to stay over here. Calm your daughter down. You know she's psycho as hell. Hey, I got mom. I got mom coming over. Uh, but if she would have just showed her ID, that uh, if she would have showed her receipt, her. why? That's her. Why? I'm like, for That's real. Her. I'm like, listen, I even did this to her. I'm like, listen, just show me your receipt. That's all you got to do. I'm not profiling. That's what I, said, I said. She's like, well, you're just profiling me because I'm black. I said, everybody that comes in the store is black. I, I, right. I can profile anybody. Right. <laughs> So what now from here? Cause so her baby is crying. She's I mean, got a, know what the hell was going on. She's she just coming to y'all and screaming and hollering. She has got a simple misdemeanor charge of resisting without. That's all I'm doing. It's a simple misdemeanor for not providing her ID for acting like she acted. Unfortunately, there's way more to it now because she got tasered and all that jazz, and and, and that's it. But you know, I mean, she's got to go to jail now because of that. So. So when will she get out? She can tomorrow. get out probably later today. Yeah, probably tomorrow. Probably tomorrow. So, unfortunately. But she's, like, she's a hothead. Oh, yeah, she, she a handful, boy. She give to I'm like, is this worth it? Like, why? Like, the last thing I want to do when I'm working here is mess with somebody. I don't want to mess with nobody. I mean, my God. I just don't. An ink pen? Here, I got a pen. I got a phone. I, I just don't. Who's she finna call? I already paid for the food just for her not to go no, her, her, She already her, paid for the her, food. Yeah, her food's already paid for. Oh! Yes. Was you listening? And you can have it. You can take it. I get her ID, too. I mean, yeah. unless you want that to go with her. I'll yeah, give it to I Mom. I mean, I, I just don't, like, it just makes no sense. I mean, you got your ID, so what? I get you feel disrespected, but I don't know that you didn't pay for it. I mean, we made a mistake by, by thinking she walked out without paying. Right. I mean, it, you know, she can get mad after that and say, hey, I already paid. Okay, well, the first thing I would have said is, I'm sorry. I didn't know. <laughs> I mean, I legit didn't know. You know, I mean, I had a guy earlier who paid for subs online. I had someone thought he was, I thought he was walking out without paying. You just don't know. I mean, there's so many scams right. that are going on here every day. You can't be right 100% of the time, you know? So, I just, uh, it's just a shame. It's just a shame. The daughter the food. There's so much going on today. 
your heart. My niece all the way out of town acting a fool with her oh, mom. Really? I got to find a way to go get her or somebody to go pick her up. Oh, my God. Whoa. Wow. Well, uh, we can walk over here. I don't know if you want to say anything to her. We'll get her out of here and get the process started. And I'm really sorry this happened. I mean, I, I just... Like I say, I, I, I have fun work. Talk to her? Oh, she won't talk. She doesn't, she's mad as hell at me. But, I mean, I, I work here. I enjoy working here. You know, I, I, I like dealing with people. Yeah. I say hello to everybody. I mean, the last thing I want to do is yeah, this. This your car? Yeah. yeah. This ain't your yeah. car, is it? Yeah. Yeah, she paid for it. Yeah. But that's, that's the thing. That's why I said to her, why wouldn't you show your receipt? Mm -hmm. Like, why wouldn't you, why would you do that? Mm -hmm. I mean, it makes no sense. So... It's just, I don't it's know. Crazy. She's just angry, I guess. Where your keys? Where your keys? Someone someone took them already. I'm about to keep oh it. Someone, I'm about to she had somebody it. here. It's my favorite about color. Keys. Oh, it I'm is? about to keep it. Here. You were? Yeah. Where your keys? He does some shit. I don't know. Look in my truck. Ain't your truck got the uh, sensitive thing on it? But anyway, oh, I appreciate God. you guys. I like I said, I, I you this is the last last thing I. Uh, you, got, you got anything else, mom? You need to tell her. Be good. Uh, Let's be good. I call the pastor. Okay. He said you getting out later on today. day. It's, she's got the lowest misdemeanor there is. I mean, that's okay. that's all we're doing. Is she should be out. I would assume she'd be out tonight. I mean, if she's not out tonight, I think tomorrow she'd be out. Yeah. So. So oh, you the one taser? Yes, ma'am. Can I get a card? I'm sorry. I can write my name down for you. Yeah. Oh, yeah, write your name. <laughs> I, listen, this is the last thing in the world I wanted to do, Mom. I mean, you know what I mean? Yeah. I just... It's okay. I appreciate y'all. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm glad that she, she usually pass out and stuff. She has issues or problems and stuff, falling out and stuff. So, it's Ke um, my first name's Kevin, by oh, okay. the way. Oh, you want that? Oh, okay. oh, you like that pen? Okay. I was waiting for someone to take that pen from me, by the way. <laughs> yeah, okay, it's got but, a good, um, good, good yeah, meaning yeah, on the yeah, side, it, too. It is. It's my so. favorite color. Well, I'm from Red Police Car now. I'm 2265. Yeah. Kevin Munger. Is okay. Well, I'm just glad it wasn't no worse than it is, and she paid for it. I just don't understand. I mean, you just tell her after. I mean, my God, if you paid for it. Thing, just show a receipt. Yeah. We don't know. We're not always 100 yeah, percent right. Yeah, they are yeah, they. Yeah. I mean, but you know, a little cooperation both ways. Yeah, uh, make we, things we, easy way. Uh, yeah, I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What <sighs> she paid for? I know it probably hurts your heart, but I mean, yeah. I'm glad she didn't get fall out of anything. No, I mean, my God, uh, I mean. Yeah, so Jesus. I mean, she's one of my sick kids. I got oh, 12 she, of them. Oh my God, do you really? Oh. Yeah, I got 42 grandkids. Oh my God. So, I mean, I maybe don't look like that, but I do. Yeah, you don't <laughs> look like that. I'll put you around, I'll put you around my age. Yeah, you know how old you? 43. Wow, that's my key number they yeah, gave me. It 42. is? 42. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, right, listen, well, I, I, listen, I appreciate it, okay, and, I, and I hope you say hi next time you come in. Okay, I will. Thank you, ma'am. You know it's me. Oh, yes, thank you. Right. <laughs> Did it look all right? What's that? That was alright. Yeah. What's your name? Uh, Tawanda. We're gonna put her in this car. Right? Okay. Hey, Miss Tawanda. I asked for nobody not to touch me. Okay. I see that, but I I want to help get these things off of you. Okay. I just, I, if, they, if, I, if a nurse, I want to go to the hospital uh -huh. or to the jail. Okay. That's it. I don't want nobody to touch me. Okay. Because all this was wrong, and I don't want nobody to touch me. That's fine. I understand that. I just want you to understand, if you do have to go to the hospital, it might prolong your stay in jail because you'll have to be cleared medically first before you leave there, before you can go into the jail. It's not going to deter or defer okay, well, any of that. Can y'all go so, ahead and take me to the jail? I'm, I'm just letting you know that that's, you do not want me to help get these probes out of you or anything like that. Because I can, I can I help you. I want to be done. I, I, I can take them out myself. I just want y'all to go You can't take them out yourself. You, you've got handcuffs on. I'm so saying I want to try. get to the jail. No, we, we can't do it that way. So I'm trying to help. I, I, I just got here. I never met you before. I don't know what's going on, but I see you got these in you, and I don't want you to be, you know, having these pokey things in you or anything like that. If I can help you get them out. Okay. I don't know what happened. I'm just here trying to help you at this point. I understand. Yes, ma'am. If y'all could just take me to the jail, that'll be fine. Okay. So that's... It's, you're not going to go directly to the jail if you refuse to let me take these out of you. You'll go to the hospital. If that's what, you, if you refuse me taking them out, that's what it is. I'm just letting you know that. Okay? That's what you decide? 
All right. Make sure it doesn't get tighter on you, okay? You trying to turn them like that? Which way are you trying to turn? Inward. It'll be more comfortable. They're inward. Yeah, this way. I'm going to lose that so you can turn your wrist inward, all right? Yeah, you just want to stay with her, keep her out. Come right here. We'll walk right here to the back seat of this car right here. And he'll clip these old wires off so you're not tripping on nothing. There you go. Stand right there for me, ma'am. Thank you. You sure you don't want me to pull those out? Okay. Saving some time. That way, uh, you know, you got to go get absentee booked and then you got to wait to clear to go to first appearance to bond out. Thank you. 
put more pressure on the, on the, uh, yeah, that's not cutting. Oh, there we go. Okay. At least now you don't have to drag this part around, okay? Can I make sure you don't have anything on you? You don't have anything in your bra, nothing like that? Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. I appreciate it. Need help. Okay. Thank you. Nosy, huh? So that's pretty nosy. That's pretty nosy. That my sister made up. Oh, that is okay. Uh -huh. I, I didn't know that. I'm just making sure. Okay, hey mom, how you doing? Fine. I'm just trying to make sure no strangers over. I'm trying to make sure no strangers being nasty. All right, ma'am. I'm just gonna need your thumbprint on this. That way we can bring you to the hospital. Okay. My thumbprint from what? It's this form. All it is is that basically saying, hey. You're going to the hospital to get those taken out versus going to the jail. Don't they take my fingerprints at the jail? At the jail, but I need this to bring you to the hospital. So I can get those probes out of you for you. I think that's that man trying, well, you're trying to find out some information about No, nah, it's not. Look, it doesn't electronic arrest report. All this is, is it goes, you go to the hospital, this goes to the jail versus you going to the jail. All right? I just told you what it is. I'll just wait till I get to the jail. But we gotta bring you to the hospital, and to do that, I need to do this. Okay, well, just take me to the jail. We can't, because we can't get the probes out. Don't they got a nurse in the hospital? They won't I do mean, it. I mean, at the jail. They won't do it, I promise you that. I just need your thumbprint, alright? I don't know what I'm signing or what I'm You're not my signing anything, it's on. just. I don't know, because he yeah. already saying shady stuff that's not true. So I don't want to do this without my. This has husband. nothing to do with him. I'm the one transporting you. I don't I wasn't hearing all this happen, right? I'm I here understand. to I'm I, here to just to, you know, help transport you, help you get those probes I out. I understand, but yeah. I don't want to put my thumbprint on nothing that I don't yeah, know exactly what it is because y'all twist stuff. It's nothing twisted. All it is is a absentee booking form. That's all it is. All right? I'll come to the other side and make it easier for you, okay? So you don't even have to turn your body. I'll just wait. You can't wait. Why well, I can't wait? I don't know what that is. I need an I attorney told you to what advise, it is. Nothing. but you're not an attorney. She's refusing to give me her thumbprint. All right. Well, I guess she's turned that way, so I'm going to go on the other side. She won't. I just want to do it now while everybody's here since they doesn't give me issues. Alrighty. We have to get the thumbprint from you. Alright, you don't have a choice. I'm trying to explain to you. Whatever y'all need to do, I'll let my attorney sort it out because I, I've never been to jail where y'all take my thumbprint. That's because you're going and to the I hospital. And I went to the hospital a thousand times, but if y'all want to do it against my right and my will, then do what y'all got uh, to do. We and will I'll get let your thumbprint, and your attorney can argue this thumbprint, all right? Do you understand? The Explain to you what the paper is, what she did. Yeah, I understand, but y'all, when people, when y'all go, somebody done got killed, somebody, I mean, somebody done got shot or something, y'all take them to the hospital. Y'all don't be trying to get no thumbprint. I see this every day. Somebody got shot. I, I'm saying, when people get shot, when people go to have to go to the hospital, they get in a fight or something, y'all. Yeah, they go never, in the ambulance, but you're not in the yeah, ambulance. Yeah, but I don't never, no because I ain't nobody never want to put me in the ambulance. They keep telling coming up to this if park. If somebody got shot, they wouldn't have told you going to jail. Listen, so but the ambulance keep coming, the, the, the paramedics keep coming up to the cars where I'm at. They saying, well, you want me to take the things off of you? They not saying, let me put you in the ambulance and take me to the hospital. I asked for a hot, to go to the hospital three hours ago. But it's not a medical emergency. Well, so how you know how I feel? And I don't want to 
haven't got tasered. I don't, but if the medical but, personnel said that. But they don't know, they never, they didn't check me out or anything. No, she's refusing to give me your thumbprint. I'm not going to argue what you, you said to those people. I have no idea what happened. I don't know what you happened can't. with the fire truck pain or anything like that. But they never you will did let them anything. To go, you will, you're electing to go to the hospital? No, I wanted to go to the hospital. I told them yeah. not to touch me right here in the car. Yeah. I said, okay. take me to the hospital. That's what we're trying to Ma'am, do. Ma'am, you can't be admitted without the thumbprint because we cannot take you in the hospital. This your thumbprint is not admission to guilt. It's so we can have proof that we took to the hospital. That's what we're doing. We're when you go to jail, you get all your fingerprints taken. I know that. So at instead of going house, to jail. But I've never did that at we can't, no car. Because you're not going to jail. House. You're taking the thumbprint here so we can show them that that's okay. you. That's all it is. You're, you're not guilty of anything. But we can't take you in the hospital without that. Are you going to sit in the parking lot? Well, he's going to drive right now. Thumbprint, he's going to drive you to the UFL right now. That's what we're waiting for. Okay. That's all we're waiting for. You get a thumbprint, and we're going, to go, we're going to drive off the UFL. Will it be easier for me to go around that side, or do you want to turn your bag this way? All right. I'm just get my gloves on for one, real quick. Yeah. yeah, she understands what. All right, just gotta be your right thumb, all right? I'm just gonna dip your thumb in here. I'm just gonna press it in. Not too much pressure, but a little bit, all right? I'm good. Uh, if they got off duty there, if it gets crazy, I'll just radio. Ma'am, the question I have a couple of questions for you. When the officer asked you, you just showed the receipt because they thought, listen, I, I know, let, let me talk for a second. When the officer asked you, just see the receipt because, listen, he was interpreting what they were telling him that somebody might have left the store not paying. You can say it was a mistake by them, not the, not the police. He's up here for that reason, so he went to talk to you, and then he said you refused. I told him. I said, sir, I did not steal. He uh, said, show me your receipt. I said, I don't have to. I, know, I said, well, let's go back in the store uh -huh. and go to the register where I went in. He okay. said, no. I said, well, I don't have to show you my receipt. He said, well, um... He said, well, yes, you do. I said, no, I don't. I said, let's go back into the store where I went at, to the register where I went at. He said, no, I don't have to do that. Mm -hmm. So he said, um, he, he, I forgot what he said next. Then he was like, well, you know, you can go to jail. I said, for what? No receipt. I said, okay, then well, fine. Take me to jail. So he said, he pulled my arm and said, get out. He, he, well, I got out. He I held my hands up wide open okay. and he tased me for no reason. And then he put, he put his feet on, he kicked me on the ground and put his feet on my head. Um, what you do though, where the, where the taser darts right now? Are they still? Stuck on me. Where at? On my stomach. You didn't let rescue try to take that out? The fire department came, they said, do you need, want, want us to help you? I said, what are y'all going to do? The ambulance, I mean, I guess that. I, I mean, don't, they could assist them and take that dart. That, well, uh, I asked for an ambulance. I asked them, I said, um, can you send the ambulance here? I need the ambulance. That, well, I didn't know it. what the fire department well, was No, they got paramedics do. on the rescue, too. But well, they he, didn't, he didn't say that. He just said, that I looked back, I seen a fire truck. I did not see an ambulance. Uh -huh. And he said, do you need help? I said, yes, I need an ambulance is what I need. He said, okay, well, she refusing. I said, I'm not refusing. I said, I need an ambulance. What is the okay. fire department? Gonna do. That's what they I, have medical people in the engine. Well, he didn't. He didn't say well. This but is what I'm saying about people. the part about the darts. We're trying to remove the darts from you. But I would have let the the, okay. the ambulance do it. But he didn't say that. If he would have said it's the fire department, but they're medics. He didn't say that. I just looked back. I seen a fire truck. Okay. So I didn't know what to, what to think. I'm like a fire truck. What they're gonna do? Okay. Listen, let me slide this back in. We we need to take it. We need to get that out of your. I have to get somebody over here to get that out of you. Okay? Okay. Okay.